I mean, there is no... It's, it's funny. The, um, I got this email from somebody. I want to be on a conference call tomorrow. It's like, so do you have a rubric about how you choose things? You know, it's like so many of this and so many of that. And do your judges put like numbers here and there? And it's like curating is not about that at all. It's, I mean, it's what moves you in any particular way. You know, when you watch something and there's something special about it, it's really obvious. You know, and it's very important. So it's not like you just, um, it's not when I start to look at work, I say, you know, I'm looking for something. I'm looking for a social issue film or I'm looking for that. If you take, like, what we've done and then update it, it's like the band that most work. There's work that I see from all over, and, and I do try to see things that are different. And I have one secret about international work. Um, you know, most people, when they look for films, they go to the same festivals. So they look at the same festivals, they go to the same kind of thing. Um, early on, I found out about this conference called Input, which is a international conference for public television producers. It's in a different country every year, and this year it happened to have been in El Salvador. So I went down there uh, on Advantage Miles, and uh, uh, and over four days, I see work from literally all over the world, and um, and I'm the only curator that's going there looking for work for a festival. Everybody else there works at public television stations, so they're sharing work with their colleagues. It's like this incredibly amazing thing. So a lot of the films that I see that are just so off the beaten track um, are things that I see there. And then I bring them to an audience here. And in some cases, they're the only, like, you know, U.S. screening that these things get. Mark and I go way, way back. Mark showed videos in the 1988 Dallas show.